Jeff Raccoon 47 here and once again for your viewing pleasure well as you know Gretchen Carlson is suing Roger Ailes for a bunch of stuff and one of the things she's citing is that her getting her own show as opposed to being kept on the morning show is a demotion <laughs> excuse me baking powder here how is, <laughs> just how the heck is being taken off a, a crappy morning show? Not, well, let me go. It's not a crappy show. It's a good show that she was on. But it came on and earlier in the day when a lot, not a lot of people were watching you. I mean, a lot of people don't watch these morning shows. But she got all upset because she got taken off the morning talk show host. Well, I would consider that a promotion, you know, good thing you're not, good thing you're not, you don't work for the Zootopia Police Department, you probably want to be kept on parking duty, you beg Chief Bogo, imagine Chief Bogo reacting to you, giving you, promoting you to detect, okay, Miss Carlson, why don't you want to be promoted to detective? Judy gave you a pie remarks. <laughs> Imagine that. But I mean, this is this is the absolute lunacy of some people. Here's a person who who is basically not even a real journalist. She's a freaking lawyer for crying out loud. Why aren't you going out and working on some big time case to to, to really make? Make everything cool in the world. Thought that's what you lawyers were supposed to be about, not whining like a little crybaby because you got got your own TV show instead of being on some morning show. But I I, I don't get this about some people. They're they're rich and they got a lot of money, but they don't have the common sense God gave to Jar Jar Binks. You know what I'm saying? If I was working at a, at a radio station or or working at a t on a TV on a TV network, and all of a sudden I got I got promoted and I got my own show as opposed to being part of a team, I would be happy as heck. But it seems that people like Miss Carlson, who thinks everything is sexual harassment and everything is all bad for her if she doesn't get her way. Well, you don't get your way in life, little missy. And just because you won Miss America back in 1989 does not make you, does not make you an expert on everything. Just because you got a law degree, that does not make you an expert on everything. It just makes you have a person that has a law degree. It just means you can practice law. And if you got put it on the firm and got past the bar. You could be Ally McBeal for all I care. And of course, and again, you probably would complain about if you got, or Calista Flockhart, you'd probably be mad that you were married to Harrison Ford instead of George Clooney. That's just how ungrateful you are. Well, I'll see you later, folks. Sorry I had to be so weird.